GC here and we are back for our first impression. Living With Yourself Season 1, Episode 1. Created by Timothy Greenberg and also written by him, we have a new series on Netflix starring Paul Rudd and a whole lot of other people. So, the basic premise is, you see the trailer and you know it, so it's right off the bat. Uh, he goes to the spa, things happen, and there's two copies of himself, and they know exactly what the real self is. Sort of sixth day with Arnold, but different, I think. But anyways, so first impression for the first episode. So we don't get a real sense of who his supporting cast is. Uh, we have the two Koreans who are in the spa. Two brawl ones are pretty, pretty funny playing off each other. Uh, as a first episode, it does use his star power really well. It starts off with him being buried and 24 hours earlier type of vibe. And we just find out that things happen and this spa thing exists. And that's it. Like his life hasn't turned around yet. So when I first saw a trailer for this, I actually thought it was a movie. Because it seems like a premise that you can just run with. And, and it'll be end in like 90 minutes or... Up uh, two hours but actually it's an eight episode series so I do wonder what they're gonna talk about obviously it's gonna be around just who is gonna do the good thing because apparently this other Paul Rudd is supposed to be great at everything his DNA is top-notch and all that jazz so maybe he'll go to work because clearly our Paul Rudd isn't that great at his job so we got that to look forward to but is it gonna be great for eight episodes who knows I mean, Paul Rudd's sort of like vibe and his character and his acting ability, I think, will be the only thing that sort of like makes you want to keep watching this. I don't think there's any other big names. I think there's a lot of guest stars. Uh, there's his wife, Aslan B, and I don't know who she is. Haven't seen anything she's done before. So there's that. Um, yeah, so as a, as a first episode, it's pretty basic. It just explains to you why this narrative happens and now we have two Paul Rudds and things don't even start. So definitely, I guess you'll be more intrigued by that so you continue to watch it. So I think it really depends on how episode two goes, if I even finish the series. I mean, it's kind of nice seeing him in Ant-Man and uh, Endgame and all that. And then now here, so it's just like, oh, I missed your acting. Same thing for Tony Stark. I mean, Robert Downey Jr. Anyway, that's it. Keep liking, keep watching, and subscribe, and share, because sharing is caring. And that's it for this first impression of Living With Yourself, Season 1, Episode 1. Out.